What is up, y'all? Y'all know what it is, man. We are back. And, uh, NBA 2K21? Demo? Yeah, if I ain't gonna check the stream, go check it out, bro. It's already with a couple hundred views already, you feel me? But, uh, this video right here, bro. This might be my build. Might, because shit might change when the full game come out. But, uh, this might be my build for 2K21, bro. I've made multiple builds. I'm already on a different account. You feel me? I do got one more spot on my main account, but I'm going to keep waiting there for a stream later today. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, that's besides the point. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, we're going to get straight into it, bro. We already know. If y'all don't, if y'all ain't hit, bro, I'm going to go to small forward. But if y'all ain't hit, bro, they, we got four new pie charts. They ain't. Should have been way more than four new pie charts. But, and, uh, they, and the pie charts that were in the game previously has been nerfed. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? I've played with multiple builds. The main pie charts I really fuck with right here. This is like the blue and green, but it's more blue than green. And the, the pure play. You feel me? Y'all already know how I be rocking with, but it's worse than last year. So don't even think that the pass first wing's back. Oh, yeah. Also, to tell you, pass first wings are dead. They cannot be revived. I don't know where the fuck they've been at. I've made multiple builds. I've seen multiple builds. I have not seen a single pass first wing on this motherfucking planet. I don't know how to make the shits. If I, if I, I mean, I, I probably can't make them, but I probably got to make the build trash, which I'm not doing. So I don't know. I don't know, y'all. But this build right here, man. You know what? I don't even know about a pure playmaking. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, don't know. I still don't know what build I actually want, guys. Um. It's it's between like I said the blue and green, but more blue and green in the pure play. And if I go blue and green, I'm gonna be six seven, and I might not even work on my interior D. Y'all know like I want to be a small forward that can guard every position, play any position. That's how I usually rock with. But this game makes that bitch hard, bro. You feel know I me? Mean? And yeah. So if I go blue and green for show sure, for show, sure, I'm going six seven. You feel me? If I go pure, if I go to pure yellow pie chart, the playmaking, I can go six seven, but I can also go six eight. I did play on the six eight. It wasn't that bad. I didn't really get any shots up. Like you feel me? But I was still going crazy, dribbling, finishing at the rack. You feel me? It just matter of fact, let me show y'all real quick, cause I don't know. I don't know what build I'm gonna make. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna go to pure speed pie chart. You know what I'm saying? A little something, something you know. All right. Like, look at the driving dunk, bro. Look at this, man. What, 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 what is this, bro? Pathetic, bro. But I'm going to adjust. I'm going to ball out. You know what I'm saying? As long as it's adjustable. There's a lot of shit out here in these streets that aren't really adjustable. You know what I'm saying? Now, this is the pair of play. So, I do... I am getting on me. I think this is how I did it. I could be wrong. Hold up. I could be wrong, actually. Um. Oh shit, yo, my webcam in the way. Let me move that shit, y'all. Hold up, let me move that shit. All right, dummy. What you gonna do for that bag? I don't think you gonna pull up and shoot for that bag. Bag. I don't think you gonna pull up and shoot for that bag. What you gonna do for that? All right, y'all. We back. Mm. So, here is the thing: so, shooting and finishing. And this because remember there's no quick draw so i could work with 11 shooting no quick draw same thing with six finishing gold contact goes through this that's all what a nigga really need i mean it could be different it could be badges that were asked last year that could be good this year and i might want to use it i don't know that's why i said i don't know i don't know what build i'm gonna really make but for right now this is these are the two builds i kind of thinking right now you know what i'm saying so um hold up hold up hold up so yeah, so like you see, I got 20 playmaking badges, and my pass accuracy is only a 74. Take this away, bro. Look, 30, bro. If I put my pass accuracy at an 86, that is 30 playmaking badges. 2K20, I had a build with an 80. At, matter of fact, I got 86 pass accuracy. I only had 20 badges. Now I get 30, bro. Like that's crazy, but that's also too much. I'm good on that. So I'm gonna just go with 20, even though I wish my pass accuracy was higher. And then a block, a 54 block. I don't even know if I really want that for real. I low key want to rise, uh, raise my uh, steel. I mean, my block. What up? Oh no, that shit. Ass, that give me six. Did that shit just go from eight to six? Oh y'all. No, it's not that bad though. Eight defensive badges, bro. You feel me? And watch when y'all see, bro. The defense is gonna get better. Uh, usually, you know what I'm saying. Especially after last year, I told y'all defined. If you even if you go buff defined, you feel me? It's defined, so you gonna be more slithery compared to barely or built. But, cause a nigga gotta go skinny? 
I gotta go skinny, bro. We're gonna go with built, bro. But you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I can go six, seven, six, eight. Six, seven, I would be able to shoot better compared to six, eight. You know what I'm saying? Even though 99.9, .9, I can still really shoot for real. It's just, I don't know if I really want to wait for the grind for my build to be a good shooter compared to now at six, seven. I'm still. Let's just look at the stats difference from six seven to six eight. So let's just look at six seven. So since I'm six seven, I honestly would probably, yeah, I will raise my, I will, yeah, I will go like 240, 244, so I can get a sixty interior D. I still got an eighty five speed, an eighty three SL, bro. You know what I'm saying? My driver layup only went minus one. That's dope. You know what I'm saying? And my wingspan huh, for this game, bro. Yeah, y'all want to max that, bro? And a max wingspan at six seven is not that bad at all. You feel me? My driving dunk, standing dunk, even though it look as I could work with that shit, bro. You feel me? As long as I can get contact dunks on my takeover. My three point uh, it goes to a 69, but I'm fine with that. If I start off at a 69, I can still green and shoot with a 69. You feel me? My shit gonna be straight. 84 ball handle. That's dope. And then, you see, we got a plus three on block, a plus one on the steal, plus two on a, a defensive rebounder. And then I could choose any of these takeovers. But who said I was gonna go six seven, man? I could go six eight. You know what I'm saying? And if I go six eight, I will have to lower my shit. Let me see. Yeah, cause if you lower your weight to a certain point, you'll get a plus one to your driving dunk. So I go at seventy driving dunk. So I'm trying to see. Yeah. So I will probably go two oh six. Not bad. Not bad. You feel me? Still max out that wingspan. You know what I'm saying for the most part. So yep. 90 and that's it that's it that's that at 68 you feel me which is only a 66 three-point shot i mean that's not that bad it's all right you know what i'm saying a lot of niggas it depends how the shooting is from so far the shooting is definitely different from 2k20 but you know we might get adjusted and i can work with that like by the end of the year but let's be honest you know, nigga, when next gen come out i'm not touching this ever again for the most part it depends you know what i'm saying so yeah looking at it i don't know i don't know if this is what i want so y'all seen the six seven six eight versions of the pure playmaker you feel me and now we're going to go to the blue and green pie chart that i also been thinking of and this joint i definitely gotta go like skinny because the speed the speed on the uh finishing and shooting pie chart always been bad especially for small fours last year you feel me Oh no, we're gonna make some adjustments, baby. Now, because this is more blue than green, I will only get Hall of Fame badges on my finishing and not the shooting, even though it's still a blue green pie chart. So, shooting, I could really drop down to, I say 12, so I can still have an 81 post eight. You feel me? We going, can we drop, we can't drop none of this down for the. I'm gonna drop this to 11 because I do like want like honestly at least seven. Let me see. There we go. I want at least seven defensive. I'm gonna change this up a little. Hold up. See, I'm not gonna be able to get any interior D if I go with this round too. See, only a 46 interior D. But as long as we get seven defense, you feel me? I'm straight. Then the other two can really go on anything. I'll probably put it on post fade. So I got 11 finishing, 13 shooting, 13 playmaking, 7 defense. The only thing I'm getting Hall of Fame is the finishing. I could work with 11 Hall of Fame. You know what I'm saying? Whatever. Uh, I will go build. This job I would go 6 7. And I'll probably make this shit minimal. Hold on. What I. I mean, yeah, I want 80 speed, 80 a cell. Yeah, I'll make this, you know what I'm saying? And max out that wingspan because that is, that is the key this year. I mean, for the most part, you know what I'm saying. I'm trying to see, as you can see, look at 83 driving dunk. You start off with. Hold on, that can't be right. All right, there we go. Max wingspan, you get an 84 driving dunk. So you start off with pro contact dunks already. Six, seven, 80 speed, 80 SL. You feel me? 84 driving dunk. You get an 80. You get a plus 11 to your standing dunk because you got long ass wingspan. Like I don't like how I got a longer, like a better standing dunk than driving dunk. That, that bothers me. I'm not even fucking tall. Like that bothers me. I still got a 71-3. You feel me? I could honestly go shorter. I don't need pro contact dunks off for it. Honestly. 
I don't know. We're just gonna leave it right there because 713, I could definitely work with that. You know what I'm saying? You know, I'm not fucking with that many, but they don't want this, whatever. 72 ball handle, 74 perimeter D, 74 still, 65 block. We got a plus four to the block, plus four to the defensive rebounding. You know what I'm saying? This build like that, and this jump, as you can see. Yeah, so it's like, I don't know. I don't know which build I want to make. This or the pure play? Y'all let me know in the, in the comment section. You feel me? I guarantee, I guarantee if I hit continue on this build and push my takeover, it's going to get me slasher. I don't want to be just a slasher. Label means something. I mean, honestly, to me, it don't put to y'all do. So I need a good label. You know what I'm saying? So just for this uh, gameplay, I'm going to choose the pure play. Because I know y'all want them pass first wing vibes. You know what I'm saying? So we need that good ass defense. You know what I'm saying? Now, if you change your physical pie chart, you will get different amount of uh, attribute upgrades. And the reason I get uh, I max out my standing dunk, simply because I need the good dunk packages as well. You feel me? I already got a low ass driving dunk. You know what I'm saying? And if you make this build at power forward, you do get the big man uh, contact dunks. If y'all niggas uh, motherfucking uh, raise y'all motherfucking wingspan. I already looked at it. I, I don't know if I'll do it though. I don't know if I'll do it. I'm a, just a small forward. Like you can make a sh you can make a six nine shooting guard, six eight point point guard, but I need to go small forward, bro. Like small forward is me. So we're gonna mess with the shits. I mean, it got this build had better defense. Look, eight defense, twenty put me eleven shooting, six finishing. I could work with that. Okay, I low-key want to get more playmaking just because, like, my pass accuracy is so low. But like I said, I'm, I'm still going to be making adjustments. I just, I need to make a build video for y'all right now because I know what y'all wondering. What build am I going to make 2K21? You feel me? And low-key, I still don't know. But we're going to figure it out together. Uh, we're going to go 6-7 because I want to get a jump shot for y'all, man. So we're going to... Uh, this jump because I'm, I'm already a cool little speed. Let me see. Yeah, so I'll get a minus one regardless. Alright, so we might as well get the plus three to interior D, which is a 60. You feel me? 244, 67, 244. That's a little past first wing vibes already because 2K20, I was 2K. I mean, I was uh, 244 as well, but I was 6'8. You feel me? In this jump, we're going to max out that motherfucking wingspan. You feel me? Do I want to do that? Hold on, I'm trying to look. What's the difference? Honestly. Uh, 84, 83, 84. My standing dunk close shot get better. St still on block. Still really don't matter. Block Loki don't matter either. Fuck it. We're going we gonna to go second to last of the wingspan. So we just had the 84 dribbling. You already know me. I'm going to go slash and take. Most likely this year, if I make a build, it's either going to be slash or take or lock take. And if I get lock take, it's probably going to be the build. The last build I just showed you on the blue and green. And it said I made a playmaker, guys. I have made a 6-7 playmaker. You feel know I me? Mean? Slash or take. I could have went lock take. That would been that would have been glitchy. You know what I'm saying? But it's whatever. And this is it right here, guys. I'm not gonna record the actual like to show y'all the build yet. I'm actually gonna save that for the stream. Cause I will be streaming again. So that means by the time y'all see this video, it will be two streams up. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. You feel me? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Please don't forget to share with your friends, hit that thumbs up button, you feel me? And everyone have a blessed day. Peace.